What's going on YouTube? This is your boy Second Accord. And I just want to do a quick video on a pretty cool tablet launcher. Um, it's a little bit different take on what other launchers do. It's called the Chameleon Launcher. Um, it was in the market and it was $9.99 which is kind of pricey. They've uh, lowered the price to $3.99 and I'm not sure if that's like a, you know, just a sale price or an all the time thing. But I do want to show you guys that uh, Chameleon Launcher is a pretty good launcher. Right now I'm running Apex Launcher. So this is your traditional Android style launcher. You have your dock at the bottom. But I want to show you guys the Chameleon Launcher. And this is a launcher that's based on making your entire screen um, widgets. And so right now I, I only have three home screens set up. But you can tap into your Facebook, your Twitter, um, you can do a news, any any website, anything that's internet based, you can pretty much use it. So if you want to set up a, if you use MSNBC or a certain program, you can set up the URL and it'll take feeds from there and display it on your home screen. So it can be used in portrait or landscape. And right now, and these are, right now, these are just two gigantic widgets and that's all it is. So if you look, if I hold this, this is the weather widget and everything can be resized so right now I just made the weather widget smaller and I'm going to make the so right now did you see weather widget is smaller calendars at the bottom and everything is resized dynamically so if I want to make the calendar widget larger all I have to do is just hold here and now the calendar is larger and what's cool about this is everything is scaled to, no matter how you hold it so you can set up so if you want it like eight widgets on on the screen you can or you can have it set up so they're gigantic in this beautiful the launcher is very smooth um, there's a nice YouTube widget um, I just reset it so it's not showing up but uh, you can type in your YouTube uh, pass uh, username and password and it'll have your subscription feeds and you can scroll up and down so all these widgets are very nice you have a power widget right here um, this is a clock widget and I just have lit literally the entire screen size but it can be resized so if I wanted to make it half of the screen or whole screen or so it's a different take on on the uh, the launcher um, it does have a dock at the bottom these icons can be set up to be different icons on on every page right now I'm just using the same ones but if you would have let's say if I want it on this page I want it just weather and calendar or something of that sort you can have it set up so it'll show just whatever you want to on each page and you see the transition animations are very very smooth there's no lag there's no stutter at all and this is running on the Samsung Gal Galaxy Tab 7.0 Plus which is it scales everything scales very nicely um, you have the button right here. This is, your, this is your app drawer. So you type in your app drawer. Very smooth. See, there's a cool, uh, when you get to the end, very cool animation. If you want to add a particular icon, I do believe you can just hold it. And you can add it to the bottom of the dock. Now when I go back, oops. Now when I go back, it's on the bottom. But you see I added the icon and it's only on the particular screen that you press it on. So you can have different uh, icons set up for each particular page. Um, these two widgets right here. These are actual Android widgets, so you can add your regular Android widgets if you want to. And I'll show you guys right here. 
I'm just gonna make a new I'm gonna make a new screen. So I have a new screen. And it's a blank screen. So touch and press to hold add a widget. And let's add a widget. And you have the option to add your own widget. So I'm gonna add native widget. And let's go ahead and add uh Let's just add, uh, let me see, the AP Mobile widget, one of the ones that comes on, on the Samsung. So now we have the AP Mobile widget. It's on there. So you do have the ability to add your Android widgets just fine. So you can fill the screen up with, with their widgets. And you can also add the your own engine widgets. Everything can be resized, so it's as easy as that. The AP Mobile has been resized and is scaled properly. That's one thing about some of these. Uh, sometimes when you have uh, these home screen replacement apps, it doesn't scale the the native widgets correctly. But as you see. So again, to add a widget, let's do another native widget. Let's try, um, let's try the Samsung memo widget. Let's just see. No, that's, that's not one. Let's try, um, um, let's, let's try the music player. As you see, the widget is on there. It's scaled properly. You want to resize it. Just touch and hold it. It can be resized. So if you really like really big, gigantic widgets that really populate your home screen, you can have a really cool experience on a, on, on a launcher. So this is a very, very cool launcher. It's just is different looking. It doesn't really look like an Android tablet. It kind of looks like like a whole another tablet. You can set your different home, uh, your different um, icons for each individual dock. And also, you have the ability to make a widget. So I'm going to show you guys that too. I've never actually done that, but um, let's see. You can go to widgets, and it says make a widget. And all you do is you just type in the website um, that you want to make a widget from. So let's say if you want to make a, I don't know, a Google Plus widget, I guess. You could type, probably type in the URL and your information and then it'll make a web-based widget based on whatever you wanted to. So it's really, really cool. Again, it is Chameleon Launcher is uh, three ninety nine in the market. And most of these are scrollable as well. And you see there hasn't been a hint of stutter or lag or anything. So this is a really cool launcher for your Galaxy Tab. 7 inch tablet. So if you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Um, if you have any comments, questions, go ahead and just leave a comment or question below. Go ahead and check out my channel. If you like what you see, go ahead and subscribe. A second accord. I'm out.